I welcome you back to the Randolph County NC Beer Review. I'm Alan. And I'm Matt. And it's been a while since I've been on here, but I'm back, baby. Oh, that was fun. And if you didn't know, it is peanut butter jelly, jelly time. time. It is a peanut butter jelly raspberry brown ale from Ooh. the Catawba Brew Company. That's weird that it did raspberry, but not get a little bit of... Not grape, but raspberry. Yeah. This is, like I said, from the Catawba Brew Company. Check the, out that can. Yeah, right? it's a cool can. It's got a peanut butter jelly sandwich on there. Yep. It is a 5.7% alcohol by volume. It also has 10 IBUs. And this has been, they've been making this stuff since April of 2021. So this is a newer beer. It's a newer beer. Yeah, I think they just do it for like a seasonal time. Where'd you get it? Uh, my son Zachary gave it to me. Thank you, Zach. I think he went to the brewery and where they made it. And while he was there on delivery, they gave him a free sample or six pack or four pack. Thank you, Zach. This one's for you. And I've never had no peanut butter jelly. Yeah, I mean, it sounds interesting. Oh, I guarantee it's going to be interesting. So I wonder, they like, make it like a raspberry jam kind of thing. I, had to be. I know some people that like it because they, they, I've heard people that they like this beer. It, and it smells like beer. And it smells like, like peanut beer. butter. I get a little bit of a jelly smell. It smells, it it smells, smells like a peanut butter jelly. It smells sandwich. like a, what's, what's the what's the peanut butter jelly? The little sandwich is divided up. Oh, the, 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 the crustables. Uh, what is uncrustables? It? Uncrustables. Yeah. Them things are the them things are that's the hit right there. Right. It's it's supposed to be after fermentation. It is rested with whole peanuts and all natural raspberry puree. So if you're allergic to these nuts, yeah, don't, don't be, be drinking, drinking this. No. It is like drinking a PB and J. Sandwich. I mean, I'm kind of excited. In a glass. I'm kind of excited for this one. Cheers. Cheer. Cheers at home, everybody. We haven't had dinner yet, so technically this could be this, dinner. This could be dinner, yeah. I taste peanut butter bread. That's weird. That is weird. I mean, that tastes like a... It's not a peanut butter jelly sandwich. No. But... I do get a peanut butter taste. You taste you taste the bread part. It's you taste the peanut butter part, and you taste a, like a. You can kind of taste the bread because you know beer and yeast, right? Yeah, it's different. It's different. It's different. I mean, it's nothing I would want. I would drink a bunch of them. No, no, this ain't my favorite beer in the world, but no. if it, it's interesting, it's definitely different. If you go to a party or something, you say, "I'm gonna try something, something different." That would that would be, that would be a that'd be nutty, good. sweet, nostalgic. I mean, that's the three words that's got describing this thing, and it's definitely not any kind of beer I've had before. It is that that can out there was made in Morganton, but I think they have a place in Charlotte. They have two places in in uh, the can Asheville, yeah, Morganton, and then Wilmington. They have a, a brewery in all the Morganton. I tell you what, we may have to take a hey, Aunt Marilyn. I'll come visit you, and somebody's gonna go to the brewery, and it ain't gonna be you. It's gonna be me. It says I best would. enjoy fresh. Well, since not that far from here, no, about an hour and a half, really. Depend on traffic. We turned this way. It's got the. It's got the. I like the sandwich. sandwich. Give me a sandwich. All right, Matthew. If you was going, would you would you would you buy it again, or would you drink it again? You know what. If it came in a single, I'd buy one just to, like, for that aspect of, hey, look what I got. Let's, let's share this thing. I would drink it on my I own. Would, I would drink it again. If I had another one, I would drink it. If it was in the refrigerator, I'd drink it. Yeah. Would I want to buy a whole six-pack or 12-pack of them? Probably, 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 probably not. Expensive. Yeah, it's probably expensive. Because, I mean, that's a craft beer. I mean, that's no, you can't go to get, like, a natural light. You know, where you get 12 of them for Or stop at a gas station, just get one and <laughs> some cheap beer. Drink it as you're going home in a bag. 
You know. Yeah, who does that here? <laughs> we don't do stuff like that. No. <laughs> but if I if you just go rate that one to ten. I would say six and a half, seven. I was going to go seven, because it's... It's good. But I, I think you would get... I wish it had more of a sweeter taste to sweet. hit the... I don't taste the raspberry at all. Really, I don't. Let me pour a little bit more in this thing, just to... I really don't taste the raspberry. It's like... I'm like you, peanut butter and bread, which is nothing wrong. I love a good peanut butter sandwich. I taste the peanut... That... On the back end, after you already got it down, it's when I taste the peanut butter. And it seems yeah. like when you're drinking it, you taste bread. But yeah, then at the yeah end, you hit the nail on the head on that one. I mean, it's not my favorite, but it is what they went after. Oh, what they went after? The, if they, they had a little bit of sweetness to it, like with the jelly. Just a little bit of more sugar to it. I'm telling you right now, that would, that would be a hit. Because mm -hmm. it don't have a bad aftertaste. It don't have that craft beer aftertaste where it's bitter. Like your IP, yeah. IPA. Oh, I can't stand an IPA. That's just me. You know, I'd say a six and a half, seven. seven. Yeah, seven. It's, it's a good beer. Not bad. Not bad. We may have to take a trip down and sit. It's not far. Like yeah. I said, an hour and a half, you know. We can go to Charlotte and be there in you know, an hour and a half from here. So, Charlotte? Yeah. They have one in Charlotte. Oh, there is one in Charlotte? Yeah. Charlotte? Oh. Yeah, I was going to be talking about Morganton Bay. Yeah. Charlotte's even closer. Yeah. Oh, they got one in Wilmington. We'll go to the beach. There you go. There you go. I'm Alan, and that's Matt. I'm and Matt. if you like our video, hit the subscribe button. Hit the notification. If there's any more of the Catawba beers that you'd like to see us do a, a review on, because I think I've done one on the, the White Zombie and Ooh. the uh, Farm, was it Farmer's Ted or something like that? Yeah. Oh, that's Farmer Ted. Yeah, that, it was good. It that, was, I like their cans. I like their yeah. the designs. Yeah. It's eye catching. Yep. Yeah. But like I said, I'm Alan, and that's I'm Matt. Matt. And this is a Randolph County NC peanut butter yeah. jelly time. Peanut butter jelly time. Where are you? Where are you? Where are you? Where are you? I know where you at. You're watching our videos.